Hello everyone, I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today we have the NA Sunday Night Fight. It should be exciting as we have a 300 man server, something we rarely see in events. But our first map here is Schoolhouse Ridge followed by the Dunker Church. You just saw an overview of both of those maps. It should be very exciting. I cannot wait. And with that out of the way, thank you to our YouTube members for the support. If you'd like to support, go below the video, hit the join button. You can see all the perks and prices there. And with that out of the way, our teams for today on the Confederacy, we have the Northern Aggression, Irish Volunteer Brigade, Pennsylvania Army, 9th Corps, Shenandoah Valley Regulars, 20th New York, Mississippi Brigade, Army of Northern Virginia, and Hood's Brigade. Whereas on the Union team, we have the Missouri State Guard, Pickett's Brigade, Hampton's Legion, Hayes Brigade, 2nd Corps, Jackson's Division, Saucy Brigade, and the 3rd Palmetto Sharpshooters. With that being said, I hope you enjoy this event. And here we are live on the Battlefield Schoolhouse Ridge. This is hype for Sunday night because we might have had two servers, but we decided to go one, and it's basically a max server, something I haven't seen in a while. So this will be hype. Uh, tonight announcing with me, uh, we got Shade. Hello, guys. Volunteer Shade of the 24th Georgia. And we got Fusewell Jackson. Hey guys, I'm my name's Fuse. I'm with the Wall Jackson of the Jackson 17th. Um, that's not a real thing, by the way. Uh, but glad to be here, Schoolhouse Ridge, man. This is exciting. It's a big, open field. I like I like this map. Don't know why they call it Schoolhouse. There's no schools or houses really for for a good couple miles. But you know, it's this one's gonna be cool. Yeah, I, I agree for that reason. It's a big open map. A lot of areas to attack. Historically, I think we see CSA. CSA has to take this corner. I've seen historically that's where they go. Uh, Fuse wall, shade. What does CSA normally do on this map? I assume shade. You know the CSA. Strategy. Yeah, I do. I've led on this map a couple of times. But um, what they like to do is gather in the corner, as you see them doing. And what I would normally do, at least uh, when I try to do, or when I lead, is I would charge down the fence with the rest of the CSA there and get up into the face of the Union. Um, so you go all the way down past the river, kind of get up to that corner there, and you shoot them for a minute. And if it's going well, you take it. If There's... not, well, <laughs> get back. And here they're starting to come down. Now, does CSA have buck and ball on this map? How's your day? Uh, I'm not sure. A I lot of regiments seem to have it. I think so. You know, it, it feels like they just got regular Springfields as they're getting shot by more Springfields and Enfields as well. Yeah, a lot of those um, shots going over right now. Sussy Brigade in front, second Corian behind. Congratulations on the sixth anniversary, belated anniversary, anniversary woo, celebration. Yeah. Six years is crazy, I, uh, but they are leading the way. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about this. You know, uh, usually I'm pretty constructive, but I mean, it's it's like even if they had buck and ball, you would only consider this if you had buck and ball. Um, and this, this is just asking to get a graveyard going right there in the front. Uh, we'll see if they stop, maybe in the creek, but but this looks like it's going to be one hell of a fight as Union. Oh, God, they just got shot up our artillery. Le shots left and right going off. Insane. Yeah, Confederates were very, very spread out in this approach. That's the one thing that's going to kill them. You can see all these dead bodies here. It's because they're trickling in, and these Union guys can just get sh easy shots on one or two men and just slowly wipe these guys. Yeah, this is really, really not good. It seems like they're making headway as now artillery is absolutely hammering that position. More Confederates all lining up on that fence line. They've actually taken up quite a position. As you can see, most of them are still standing. Union is kind of faltering here. I'm really surprised. Oh, my God. Yeah, TNA, work TNA and V is trying to get a flank here. They are. CSA smart about this. They're keeping their flags back to keep people funneling off of the creek and into the main line. CSA is looking like it's actually going to win this, this engagement in full detail. Um, they have a majority of their guys and Union has now faltered in the center. The right flank is still holding somewhat. Yeah, and oh Union's boy. losing a lot of tickets. I mean, look at that a ticket lot, count. A lot it's of tickets. It's not even close. Damn. This is Full tap on morale stage. Mesa oh, here yeah. pushing his guys very close to the Union line here. They want to push them off. And CSA might decise. I mean, it's still kind of close here. Um, this is going to be very bad for Nice Union. team kill from CSA, CSA artillery, artillery. Nailing the rear. Of, uh, who was that, MSG or something? MSG uh, or, uh, yeah, MSG 6LA. Um, 
A and V's on this flank. You see ninth core. You got Mac here from 6LA getting two kills. Can he get a third? Three and goes down. How many guys are on RD for uh, the USA? Oh boy. So artillery wise, uh, Confederates have eight and Union has uh, what? Eighteen? Like more than fifteen? Yeah. Dude. Eighteen. I mean, they, need, uh, they need to fix that. But I, it's mostly 18? because the Union has to push their cannons over the berm, which takes time. Yeah. Uh, by the way, CSA decisively winning the center field. Now, this is not going to be good for Union as they kind no. of completely rethink right. their strategy. As, in case you guys don't know, over off to the northeast, right on the horizon of where right we're looking, left. that's an entire hill. That is indeed where they spawn. The Union has to come down from that hill to even get within 400 yards of point. Yeah, you that's, can see him. Uh, you can see him. You can see him, and that's... CSA now hopping over the fence to gain a fourth position. Boy, Ninja I like the way they're the playing way. this. This is very nice. PA, there's PA. We talked about that PA promo video about that. Uh, <laughs> you know, one video. They're the guys that lead the way. Unreal. Actually, quite interesting. CSA, some of them departing from the main line. Fifth NC looks like they're going to try to get a flank on the remaining Union at R here. IVB, ninth core. Um, but no, CSA is wiping this field completely. It's devastating unions trying to looks like some unions reorganize back. yeah i don't know yeah. uh mississippi brigades holding up at the end there tna guys look like they're going that way as well uh you see a and v and killer leading his guys that way and a lot of union gathering on the point so unions trying to readjust here the problem is is because they're so spread out skirmishing out of line deaths are going to be the theme for the next couple of minutes so this will be interesting. Well, I mean, look how scattered the Union is. Yeah, but they can at least fall back to the other side of the field here, and I think they're probably going to try to do that. I mean, you see a lot of them already heading in that direction, but they still have a lot of people just lost in the field, so I think that's going to be a big uh, issue for tickets. 100%. Yeah. Just like these guys right here, they are. I mean, CSA should be wiping these guys, and they are. But bulk of the Union getting back to the point where it's over a half wow. a morale stage difference here. We are just about seven, yeah, just about seven minutes into this game. Union practically at engaged, most likely will hit it at 35 or 34. Uh, that's not good for a map like this. I don't no. think the Union expected the ferocity. I, I certainly didn't. Uh, yeah, good, good job to the CSA for bracing that initial attack. Um, wow, this is definitely going to hurt them and the long con. If they do choose to to do the long con strategy of shooting from afar that initial engagement uh going down a morale stage in less than 10 minutes is not ideal uh looks like the rethink of their strategy as they're getting cannons set up now yeah uh, union is going to definitely get some payback here union's shifting a lot of their guys to the very very far right let's see this let's english this shot from genie <laughs> oh god yeah, he can do it well, we, got the, we got a it's, beautiful it's, view. You could probably honestly just set the cannon down and, and just fire it anywhere at that blob. I don't think you even got to take two seconds, more than three oh, seconds to just, aim. Someone's getting beat. He's beating um, his teammate. Genie. Maybe War thinks he's actually a genie and he's trying to rub the lamp. And his wish was granted. <laughs> Jesus. Why, why did that happen? What? Why do we have to resort to violence in these situations, fellas? When war wants War. Shoot the gun. There we go. It was short. A little bit short. Maybe Shrapnel got artillery. a couple guys. CSA artillery is nailing them for, per shot. Wow. That was that was uh, quite the start. I'm not going to lie. That was, uh, that was impressive. Wow. That was a very big start and a very big lead, actually, as CSA has more than three quarters of a lead in the morale state. And it's very, very, uh, time and time again I say this, it's very hard to come back as a defender with a ticket deficit because you have to put yourself in a position to engage and that means taking some hits and if you're down in deficit it's uh that's very hard to come back from but you see him getting some good shots here over the creek uh fifth NC. murphy fifth NC with jd yes, murphy is returned long returned after his absence from war of rights <laughs> love to see him back he's with jd and sr as well they're the most forward csa group more csa pushing in as well sussy yeah. brigade 
We love to see it. Taking uh, a little stroll through the, through the creek. You know, I love to get, do a little swimming here on the schoolhouse ridge. Um, but CSA is keeping guys back, making sure they hold this position, the bulk of their team's back here. Um, I'm really glad they pulled off some forces off that fence. Uh, because that is bad for Union artillery if they get if they get a nice shot at that big clump. It seems like CSA read that and more Union pushing into the ridge itself into the lane. That's interesting. So yeah, most of the Union team here. I'm intrigued who's on the far right. Hayes Brigade looks like they wanted to decap that point a little. Yeah, uh, what is this? Uh, another vigilante group? Or? A and V. Oh, yeah, you know the most vigilante group here. <laughs> uh, they're uh, charging these two artillery right? men. Oh no, that cannon is very much I so I don't know why CSA up. would ever take this artillery on this map. He's still trying to aim his gun. Let's see, Vanzio, can you hit your shot? Misses. I don't think he's going to have enough time. Hobson no. is going to remain on the site till the end. Is he going to be able to get what? on the... Oh my god. Oh, god. I thought he was going to get it. Good job, killer. He was too. You got your two out-of-line kills. Dang, I'm surprised CSA even considered taking that artillery position. Um, yeah. Um, Union hitting same goes same goes for CSA. Yeah, there's the engaged uh, minute late from the predicted 35, but still around that time. It's it's just a matter of time now. Union really has to come up with something, I believe. Um, they can't Turtle. keep sustaining this fight. Yeah, yeah, just yeah, leave the field. <laughs> next map. We're, next, we're, we're going done. Map. We're they, going to Dunker. We're going to win. The Union that. turtled so hard that they went away from the actual playing field, and now it's on to the next map. They're in a different state. So Sussy We're Brigade. In the wrong campaign. Sussy Brigade's going far left. I see 50A, PB, PA here. JD still holding here from earlier. I'm intrigued to where Sussy's gonna go. If they're gonna try to hit A and V, and it looks oh, like we're gonna see head the... on. Head on collision right here. Killer going down. <laughs> oh no, they're actually gonna stand still while an entire company is now engaged. A and V gonna start taking shots left and right, getting engaged from God knows where. Vietnam tactics. Right here, they cannot sustain this fight if they want to take this lead. This is not the way to go about that. More shots coming in. CSA, let him have it. They do have a bush in their way, though. That's uh, okay. They are getting good shots. A and V starting to push back here. Wow, what a great view. Nothing like the lovely feeling of seeing the guys you were shooting at now running away in the opposite direction um and we could not sustain that fight that was a good call before they took too many hits so union falling further back to this right side giving up the point of contention csa doesn't want to cap because if union finds a way to recap uh they will go up to the total percentage of tickets that the unions are, are these guys team killing each other <laughs> yeah, yep, that sure was. All you had to hear was one my bad. And that's your confirmation right there. I also believe Union Artillery uh, oh, yeah. fired on that position. I don't know what's going on. Man, what, are we in the Twilight Zone? Is, is everybody just against the Union today? Uh, yes. Jesus. The Union doesn't even want to win. <laughs> I don't think there was much faith in this map before it started. Uh, it's a hard map for Union to win. No, I, I mean... Especially when you lose a corner like that. CSA beginning to push up. We see Mesa here in the 6LA. They're uh, hopping over. They are indeed. You Into got the middle of the road. More coming from behind. Uh, Union using going. this hill as cover. Um, speaking of which, let's see who these guys are. Uh, a HL Hanthems Legion, newly formed. Here comes 6LA. They're all by themselves, though. Maybe they're just using this as a defilade for cover, but I don't know why when they're going to get hit from this side here. Yeah, this is the meat grinder, and I like the initial idea, but what's that famous quote? Ah, yes, sir, I believe we've gone a fence too far, or bridge, <laughs> something like that. Yeah, no, 6LA is in a nasty spot. They need someone to come up and help them from the side. You can see, I'm assuming that's Sussy moving that way. I mean, these guys are in a better position. Honestly, 6LA should be on this fence line here. Just as uh, Fusewell said, a fence too far, and they're falling back. As the four guys of that attack remained, however, some LA guys are holding the line to cover the retreat. That is indeed smart. This is all a stalling tactic, because as you can see to the north, there is indeed a company flanking all the way around. CSA trying to make some maneuvers on this entire Union company. 
Uh, they will respond, A and V, I believe, with the yep. blue flag. Kill Trying to get some payback for their lost brothers. What is this? Is very spread out here. I don't know if these guys are just trying to scout. It's Huncho. They are scouting. Oh, God. Okay. They are falling back. Yeah. However, if they do decide to go down the middle, perhaps they can actually still make this work because now this Union Company is absolutely isolated. Murphy is going to make the call. And they're going to try to engage. More Union Artillery try just literally only hit the flag. And they are going to make the call to engage. Shots now coming out from the CSA side. The flag goes down. A and V though, lighting it up. Impressive by A and V. Fifth and uh, very good. Looks like twenty uh, third. Oh, M M M. Oh, Midwest Brigade. My bad. <laughs> I haven't I haven't seen you guys in battle in a long time. <laughs> Here's Mississippi Brigade. Who is hopping up and over the PA? PA. This is going into the promo video again. <laughs> this is definitely what the, oh, the, them dying. Oh God. Uh, uh, I, I thought they were gonna kill like maybe 15 more guys with their look. Uh, maybe I over, you know. Right. I thought, you know, yeah. they, they, they had they had a saying like 10 of, you know, one of them was like 10 of the Yankees, but you know, um, it was a good attack. I like that. But stay right there. Good. Oh, we got IVB doing some rising volleys here. Oh yeah. They're actually gonna catch the CSA on the tail end. They, they drop the flag. a flag. Flags are being shown no mercy in this game, it seems like, no, as we see no. those dropping left and right. Who is the CSA guy? Dang, I wish I could have seen him. I know, right? That was fucking guy weird. was just chilling there. Y'all didn't kill him? I'm still like, <laughs> tired. God. Oh. You know, yeah, you just have random CSA guys. Yeah, that must be very bizarre. You just have random people sitting on the fence. More CSA artillery coming out and be holding this flank, but... Murphy's you, still down there. Un, Union has done an impressive job since losing that corner. Um, but it's not like CSA has really made any frontal assaults. Um, right but are we going to see a cap? That ticket, mar ticket margin has decreased. Yeah, the cap is speeding up. Um, Who's capping? To add, Who's to add on, I don't actually know. Oh, hey. um, oh, yeah, it, it is them. Yeah. I didn't realize CSA could cap all the way from that. Yeah, that's, that's far I'm out. gonna hold on, give me a second, I gotta write that one down. <laughs> Capture an entire lane via creek, got it. Of course. So JD, JD 6 LA pushing up here. Find as much hard cover as you guys can. Spread it out, spread it out. Spread it out. Cover, skirmish. <laughs> they really need to spread out, apparently. And the shots have finally come out as they now yeah, engage on the top of that hill. Another flag goes down. Wow. Flags are not spared in this warfare. No, they're not. Uh, this is probably the most amount of flags I've seen go down in any game in the first 10 minutes. I mean, this is getting insane. This is one hell of a fight. They're all club <laughs> things. <laughs> they're like penguins. What are we, in Antarctica? These are the penguins from Madagascar right here. Now HD going up. Yeah, he's brigade. Like massacred in that field. What? Uh oh. For some reason, I was like, oh crap. They're pushing forward. This is a general assault. Nope, it's just them. HP, they actually volleyed uh, yeah. the Union on top of that ridge, but they're going to hold right here to maybe catch them by surprise. What's up, boys? I'm pretty yeah, sure they can hear them for that distance. I'm pretty sure they can hear them. I'm not your friend. Oh, no. Ah, <laughs> oh, boom, boom, just gave them up. They're in the ditch. At least one of them. Yeah, they don't shoot, don't oh no, oh no. They have been made. Oh, two go down, TSA cap. Oh, these guys just subbed themselves. Uh, death wish. Boom boom, ruin the surprise. Oh, here they come. Oh wow, that was, wow. Actually, that was actually impressive. <laughs> Took out about maybe six or seven there. Maybe they do have buck and ball, or, or maybe they just are very accurate. That was a very impressive volley, by the way. Wow. Uh, CSA starting to reposition, maybe going to the point to try to hold it. You see MSG here as well. Uh, and Union is starting to go to the point because if Union retakes this point, uh, they go back up to the total percentage of tickets that the CSA is at, and that'll be huge for the Union. Um, 
And on top of that, if they recap this quickly, uh, the Union can keep that black timer going down and get a lot of tickets. It's it's huge for them, so they got to go. Holding the point for the CSA. Um, we got... Oh, that's a lot of guys. First Delaware, Hampton's Legion. See some 50A tags as well. Union now coming down the middle of the road as well as on the right side of the fence. I'm not sure about this little maneuver, but we'll see if it pays off right here as the entire army is I mean, now coming down. They 100% outnumber them. Rest of the CSA arriving, though. Here we go. Oh, uh, Union's got to oh, Union's got to take this front fence before the CSA guys. They have, have to move. They have to move. Another Union artillery shell comes in. Unknown effect, but more CSA now pushing on the fence. We got a beautiful angle. I think CSA is going to be able to hold. I mean, you see Union flags in the distance. Not all of Union pushed in here. Wow. Wow. Amazing shots going, going down. Yep. CSA it's engaged. But I think Union, yeah, they got almost virtually decimated as now more CSA is just piling. This is something from a scene of a movie, like Enemy at the Gates. The Russian army is just closing in. Oh my god. Except it went well this time in the books. <laughs> uh, JD here, 6 LA, starting oh, to flank the Union. They did not expect it. They're looking the wrong way. I think we saw a couple charges on the right side as well. Uh, you can kind of see some flags remaining there, but it looks like that was more of a distractionary force so that this CSA force could hold the point. Union's almost down to taking losses. That shot had a long fuse, killing their own teammates. <laughs> it's just chaos. I have no idea. There's not really much to say because it's all, I mean, you know, it's right in front of you. CSA, though, well, I will say this is actually very decisively, again, going to be able to hold that point in mass, and this actually gave CSA more of a lead. 100%. And we got nine minutes wow, CSA, man. nine minutes to hold this. And I mean... This is not good. <laughs> Union is in a terrible, terrible position. And I'm really looking forward to see how they're going to navigate this battlefield with nothing but hills left and right of them. Yeah, because uh, their spawn is right there. Here they come. I, uh, they come. I wonder if the best approach is to try to go for that corner, but CSA can easily react. Yeah, this is going to be very hard for the Union to overcome. Um... It is very hard for a Union team to react on this map once they've been kicked off the front line of that field because there's nowhere they could really go to at this point. The CSA has a lot of the field under their control and they can kind of just shift wherever they want and block them off and just keep them out. But they got to somehow figure out how to condense themselves to a point where they can charge and get that point back before the game ends. It honestly might be this right flank because the Union still has a firm hold here. The shots being engaged with the Hayes Brigade guys. TNA, Midwest Brigade, A and V. Just a mix of everyone here. Uh, a mix of everyone and they were able to hold the line. Now that's going to give a Union an in. An open door as MSG and all those guys. Second amount, you know, MB, all the... <laughs> just so many so people many regiments. from every cover. So many regiment. PA, but we got PA too. Good lord. This is, uh, but as I said, it's, it is going to indeed open up a door for them to at least reinforce. Because that's the big thing with Union is that they won't be able to reinforce once they completely lose that field. Um, they're going to hit, probably taking losses in the next 10 seconds here uh, if they keep yeah. this up, however. It's not, it's not the end of the world. I mean, tickets honestly don't really matter for the Union team right now. It does, however, put pressure on them. The lower and lower they get, the more they feel oh, obligated. Yeah. Yep, they hit it right there, taking losses. The more they feel obligated to try and muster up an attack to regain the tickets lost. Um, no, but yeah. let's see how they handle it. CSA. Union artillery getting a nice hit. It's got to hurt. I, I mean, unless Union, whenever the counterattack phase starts, you got to be aggressive. I don't know why we see Union kind of sitting around here right now. We got Wolfie here. Missing his shot. Most of the time, it's it's most likely that sometimes the whoever is playing the now attacking force underestimates the amount of time they have. Six minutes is not a lot. That's how long I take to take a shit. And <laughs> honestly, you just wrap that up very quickly. Let alone take an entire goddamn field. I mean, Jesus, they get hit by yet another Union artillery cannon. CSA might actually get uh, very much messed up. Perhaps maybe that's what they're waiting for. Union artillery? Oh, yep. Did that, did that even kill anyone? That didn't kill anyone. That uh, didn't. 
<laughs> Guys, artillery is good. <laughs> you know, you know, you, there will sometimes post clips in like the War of Rights Discord of like. Oh, that great... should have killed a lot more. I really should have. They'll post like one clip of great artillery, and they'll be like, "Guys, artillery is so great." You see this footage, and it's like, how many of those shots did they miss beforehand? Um, Union starting. Here's to come a charge. Out. Yeah. Let's get another good. CSA angle on moving this. into creek to try to possibly flank. Yeah, PSA's kind of fallen back to regroup with everyone. Wow, what a beautiful angle. Oh, this is a beautiful angle. This is the only chance, possibly one of two chances the Union has to retake this field. Now Union pushing in, shooting CSA left and right, the flag still waving high. Union, Union charging in the creek. Union ground. More CSA running up on top. They're coming out of the woods in the distance as well, hitting that Union group in the creek. It's, it's I don't everywhere. think this is going to go well for Union. No, Union I, seems yeah. to be losing this fight, unfortunately. They have their flags back trying to reinforce, but I I, I don't think it's going to be enough. Yeah, CSA is wiping at the creek here. Not a lot of Union left, and wow. Those flags should try to get out. If the flags go down, I do believe it is over. Get killed. Get killed. Yeah. Here's one. Just keep oh, we got two more. You lose your flags, you lose your battlefield presence. The ability to sustain a fight. The flags, all three flags now, or whatever's left, are now all clumped up. Giving CSA nice shots on him. CSA now pressing the attack. One goes down, two more. They're surfing. <laughs> Just run. Oh, please. Just run away in a straight line. Shoot him, shoot him. Ah, oh, he goes uh -huh. down. <laughs> oh, maybe to recover that. Uh, oh, these guys don't want them to get the flag. Hey, they got that one flag out that was falling. Wow, that's impressive. That. that was that was in the middle of the goddamn road. And who I is this man? Who is him? Hmm? No! What, what did he do? Oh, oh yeah. no! Oh yeah. Sir, battle scars on Sir. the flag. Sir, please. What are these guys doing standing here, by the Pick way? They, CSA has open shots on everything in a 180-degree angle. <laughs> we do have some uh, Union contending the point here, though. We got beef here. Beef! <laughs> 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 that would have killed these two guys. I can't believe what I'm watching. This is... Who's, uh, who's counter, our counter, counter, battery, counter battery? Oh, I got a kill! Ooh. He's all the blood. I don't know why oh, yeah. you're counter battering on a map like this. Yeah, three minutes. Someone's playing some inspirational music here. Where is this man? I thought it was Tar Gray for a minute. I'm like, no way. I can't find this man. That's probably one of these three. But. Union wants to hit from the right side again. And they only have one more opportunity to do it. Some... So two un, these two Union guys are still somehow here. Lord Grand Admiral Moore, though. Gonna stop him. He's actually talking to him. Roy, you better hit this. Hey. <laughs> HB moving down the fence, trying to stop the Union, but they, I mean, they're going to get shot up. It's a whole lot of Union there. Oh, yeah. Uh, just a quick checkup. Uh, sorry to break it. Uh, am I okay on the audio quality? I was. Oh, you're great. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is, again, I'm surprised CSA kind of let them in an open door. But it seems like Union is just going to stick to the same strategy of charging the other side of the fence right into a withering fire of the entire CSA army on that fence. Union dying left and right before they even get the shots off. What a beautiful sight. Only for one side. I... That took a lot out. I thought I'd see a lot more Union drop in here. It's, it's, it's trickling. Bodies are dropping left and right. CSA furiously ramming their rods as the Yee Yees come out as they are expecting 
this charge coming out from the Union. They're, in fact, I don't know where they're going. What, to Valhalla or something? They're just, uh... Oh, oh Fifth NC going point. in for a flank. This is not going to work out for the Union. Yeah, Union just oh. tried to get... I think Union tried to get more bodies on point, but... Uh, no. I mean, this is just... Yeah. All right, here we go to the slow, painful death of the Union. Union actually some, still slow. has a foothold, but there's so many CSA. Union's going to yeah. be trickling in from spawn. They're starting to see it right now, but... The, the Union right now is outnumbered by 2-0 to zero right now, and this is a slow, painful loss right here. As CSA, hats off to the CSA for being able to hold as they're just... Holding the line here, that's all they had to do. Uh, um, can't say I'm impressed by the, the Union strategy of, of doing the same thing go. three times in a row. Here they go. You hear Zapstar, they're Zapstar. going. Zapstar. And that will do it for this <laughs> round. What a great first round by the CSA. Was, yeah. I mean, it's, it's a hard well. map for Union to win. Uh, but you losing that corner right away is terrible. Shade, your thoughts for the round? Honestly, tough start for the Union. I mean, they can't really do much once they uh, take that uh, corner there. But beyond that, really great, uh, well played by the CSA. They played amazing there. You as well, your thoughts? Agreed. Definitely agreed. CSA probably played that to the perfect T with a surprising first strategy of attacking a fortified fence line and taking on that right there that withering fire just a bunch of muskets popping off they were able to push them off it's off to them for keeping their heads strong and i guess getting the job done this felt like more like a csa uh simply outplayed I don't, i'm not sure if that's an accurate assessment in terms of, of what happened here but it, it really did seem like the csa just moved more fluidly than the union and that's what got them their well-deserved hard-fought win that's off to you guys, huh? Indeed, and with that being said, we'll see you in the second round. And here we are live on the second map here, looking at our numbers quickly. Uh, five men in balance in favor of CSA. The big thing is looking at artillery. 16 men on the Union. One on the CSA. One. So That's all you need, one guy. One guy, and the officer. Yeah, pre pretty much, you know. I mean, just line up a cannon on that road over, over by the man. church. Just send it down one of the flanks, you know, it's, it's take your pick. I only need one guy on that cannon. Wow, Union yep, is here. absolutely going to take CSA to task on this left side. It seems adamantly MP pushing somewhere towards the middle. They're breaking off. <laughs> what is this? HD. <laughs> going straight for it. Dad, Boners. Dad. Fucking dads, Jesus. <laughs> so I don't know what's going on over there. <laughs> You know the Union, totally in Alabama. But uh, Fifth NC holding up in the center rocks. I'm intrigued to see how the CSC defend themselves. They have enough men to kind of protect the whole field. You have Second Corps, you have Pioletti, the man, the myth, the legend himself, here on the battlefield. I don't know if he was here last round. I see uh, Hampton's Legion as well holding this left flank. Um, fifth NC falling back because we have HC pulling up. Let's quickly look at everyone else on the CSA. Sussy Brigade kind of holding behind the church. More Sussy Brigade. That's such a crazy thing to say. So, <laughs> Could, uh, I, I would never imagine in my 22 years of living that I would be saying a sentence like that. Sussy Brigade. Oh, Sussy Brigade. So, How whoops. is that? Is that Zapstar? It is Zapstar. Yes. Star is such a great leader. He's very charismatic. Oh he my is. god. He, yeah. Speak. Goodness. Tickets, lads. That's the name of the game right now. There we go. <laughs> that's all. That's all needs to be said. Yeah. Zapstar knows what's up, and he doesn't need to. Oh my goodness. Union so, just pushing down the middle like hounds chasing after a bone. They're gonna hop over. So historically, Union pushes this right side, and we can see CSA kind of pushing out there. IVB, maybe Ninth Course flanking around. But normally, Union wants to take this nipple position here, and uh, they, they took it within the first five minutes. CSA isn't really putting up a fight. Historically, if Union get this corner position or get in the back of the woods, it's game over for CSA, but CSA kind of gave it up. Yeah, I think CSA is confident that they can get different angles. As you see on the northern flank, CSA firing into the rear of HD, also firing from the wood line. 
Um, this line right here is engaged from also the left side. A lot, a lot of flanking maneuvers going on. You can see Ivy B up there, but this is already the weirdest Dunker Church maps I've seen in my life. Yeah, uh, I don't know. You know, I, I, I don't think CSA expected Union to, to come down that hard and, and, and quick right down the center, but it seems like JD is in fact going to get into the firefight now and take some shots at him. This is not going to be good for Union. That's very good shots that they have. Remix is going to order a volley possibly or what just I, take a gander. We got Simp here on top of the gate, but uh, our fence. What I mean by weird is I've never seen CSA push out this far because they're so exposed and we can see yep. uh, IVB, 9th Corps, uh, Midwest Brigade, they're going to win this pretty decisively. Union still down on tickets though, 5th VA moving in as well. Yeah, I'm not sure about the 5th uh, VA move, that's going to cost you a lot of out of line tickets which is going to even out this game as you can see on the top. Now the battle ready status for CSA is going to take a hit. Union, however, might overextend here into whatever company this is on the fence. They're going to get cocky and they're going to fire into this wood. Here we go, Hayes Brigade. Oh, God. Hampton's leading. Peppering that bush. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So Union still hold the corner. JD falling back into the woods. Sussy so Brigade kind of holding behind the church still. Um. Yeah, you know, uh, I think playing for time is out the window at this point. It's it's definitely just going to be uh, seeing who can get the better edge of the morale state. I don't like what Union is doing here, with, uh, paralleling themselves to the line, because now you're just reducing half the amount of shots, although they are engaging that right side, which is good. But now you're kind of exposing yourself from an entire formation uh, charging a column. That's not going to be good. Uh, but I don't think CSA doesn't seem too adamant about pushing up, rightfully so. Can't waste the tickets, as we're already down halfway on both sides, just about, maybe. Speaking of this, JD. not pushing forward, JD's pushing forward. <laughs> and I don't, know why they, shit. I don't know why they're standing in the open here. Union not hitting a lot, which is kind of sad, and oh, this is fascinating. Uh, MSG just kind of charging out. I don't know why they're doing this. This is not uh, maybe it cause confusion. This is not the ticket have farm strategy either. for CSMs. But then why would you charge more guys? Than, oh my dollar. god! Oh. <laughs> we are getting some good shots. You know, CSA is indeed getting some good shots off. Um, keeping it even, surprisingly. A lot so of CSA far. starting to shift over to the center here, where we saw JD. Uh, happening on this flank, you see MB kind of getting shot up a lot. IVB 9th Corps um, engaging with Hampton's Legion here. They're getting some nice shots on them. You still see uh, Hayes Brigade and part of 2nd Corps holding there. rest of the CSA actually beginning to move out to this flank here. Are they charging? Here comes JD. They're going to try to hit this Union group and push them off completely. I think CSA is definitely feeling cocky about the fact, I mean, I don't know about what, but pushing up from the safety what? of the wood line should definitely yeah. be frowned upon. But if you have a good flank and you see an opportunity, then good on you. Their flag goes down, so maybe it's paying off, but man, can they really risk going into this woodland and getting possibly flanked from any goddamn nook and cranny from the bushes? JD is actually going to commit to this charge as Union is just sitting there ready for him. Yeah, JD wow. is winning Arson, unsupported. Arson. Where are these teammates? These guys need to help them out if JD's charging in. I don't know what this is about, uh, to be honest. This is very questionable. Some JD guys are able to kill more than two, but they're like, going to go down as well. Like, this ticket difference is not that di huge. And these out of lines that we're seeing, like, great kill, though. Uh, these out of lines that we're seeing, it really... Yep. Are causing the CSA to losing uh, lose this game right now. Still CSA people running through there. Yeah, actually Union is getting whittled, whittled down right there. There's not a lot of them left on that flank. Um, CSA could I guess out. I guess good job, you know. Uh, but. Now, actually, Union has a tiny bit of a lead because that was a lot of out-of-line tickets they sacrificed for that. Confederates are going to go down to engage here. Oh, 
yeah. Other than that, you know, uh, I, I, I would have expected, you know, the, the usual strategy, at least, and, and from what I can tell, is holding the woodlands. You have good cover. They can't see you past 200 yards. The only way they can really see you is either with binoculars or you have, like, 2010 vision, I guess. Union now charging A and V, HD guys, I guess. Doing the same thing the CSA is doing and just getting slaughtered. <laughs> Fucking, I don't... <laughs> These charges Five, feel so eight, random. Seven guys charged for one guy, and now these guys are getting dropped. But the they do hit engaged. The wow. Not surprising, to be honest. This is such um, a trickle in. But see, Union can feel comfortable doing that because they know they can at least lose some more tickets. Uh, even though it is close, right? Uh, they're probably going to hit engage for the next 10 seconds. Wow, there's not a lot of... Yeah, you know, why would they charge? Anymore. It's going to take a long time to reinforce, and I'm sure they're hoping that the CSA doesn't take exploitation of their weak status in the center. Union got pushed out? On the left side as well, wow. So the CSA seems to have cleared the field, but at what cost? A morale state is what it costed. And B... Costed is not a word, by the way. Metal. Come on, Metal, you got this. I don't actually know if he hit that. He hit that one. You got a line tickets. I, I don't see the point. Officer, here they come, boys! They're not, none of them are reloaded! None of them are reloaded, Metal! Just this is so badass! <laughs> like... Metal might be him. Well, we didn't catch it on camera that he died, so he never died. He just went to a different place instantly. He's still fighting them in hell, probably. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just gonna, he's talking to God right now. Give me a second chance. Oh, most definitely. But wow. MB able to wipe that little, I don't know who that was, like a small skirmishing yeah, company it or something. like HB or HL, one of the two. But Union, a lot of the guys dying, moving back up here and engaging again. Great, yeah. great news from Milo right there. Uh, I, I love hearing random screaming when there's really relatively nothing going on, you know? Like, sure, you guys are popping off some shots, but it isn't like, you know, yeah. wow! Like you're getting charged or anything. It's just a passive, you know? It's like a fucking arcade game at this point. Wow. Guys, you didn't have to drop to engage yet. Yeah. Just sitting right there for a while. JD is pushing up to these rocks here, trying to get some nice closer shots on them. Yep, and you know what? They still haven't hit engaged, and CSA is already 10%, just about 20% digging into their status. Again, same as the last map. Hard to come back from a deficit like this as you're slowly trickling away. Now JD running into an open field on the right flank of the Union in the center. They're going to take some possible skirmishing tickets right there as uh, 6LA pulls back. I don't... Yeah, I don't know why these guys are pulling out as far as these are. Sure, it's a nice angle, but your guys are crouching here. They're going to get be dying and skirmishing out of line like those guys just Exhibit died and skirmishing. A. And now there's only four left, and now the last three guys are indeed going to die. Skirm oh, come back, JD. Come back, JD. Make it three. Look, hey, man, I'm not a prophet. Kill? I'm not a prophet or anything, but look, it, it, it's just, you know, literacy of, of what's going on at this point. I mean, you stand out there way out of position you're probably gonna get shot and i think it's easier said than really enacted but you know exhibit a of why you don't push out there sure got I, th I still think they got a chance though you know i don't think this is all entirely lost but you know it's really hard to cheer on the csa in some parts of these uh with some of the maneuvers they're doing uh it seems like they're trying something different but it's the wrong kind of different i feel you don't like that they're pulling back into the woods no, I don't like change. I wish we could get new government sanctions on certain countries. And honestly, <laughs> at this point, I would, you know, suck a messiah ASAP. I would, I would most definitely call up some country and get this figured out. Because Jesus, <laughs> this is not good. That church is under threat. Look at how many holes in there. All right, that's an attack on God. This was the 17th century, 16th. You know, there would be a crusade. But HD now pushing the church. They don't like God, apparently. Or I guess the two people you. behind the church. The one. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make sure Tagre is not giving his service in there. Uh, <laughs> it's not a house. They're clearing it. Nobody in there. Clearing it. Is Union gonna take point from this? Let's see if they're organized enough. Most likely they are. Yeah, those guys just kind of peeped out. 
But the rest of the Union, they're, they're shooting from a far ways away, are they? They're not gonna cap. But interestingly, some TNA guys, 65th Illinois, they're probably some skirmisher group. This is really smart. We have a ginger. TNA, yep, he have red TNA hair? now knows that they're not behind the church, and they yes, know that a redhead is holding behind the church, so he's not letting that go. Okay, maybe they get shot to shit, but you know. One of them died, the ginger lives, huzzah. That's why you gotta be ginger. Exactly. Oh no boss, still. <laughs> Krog oh, having the time of his life Shit shooting out. at the Yankee deaths. Jesus, this is a somber scene. But you know, somebody, somebody get him some water. <laughs> He's still going. What is so funny, Krog? We gotta, we gotta we ask missed Delaware. It. We whoever comes, it. Yeah, whoever comes from Delaware. Boss will show up for the post game interview. Don't worry. Let's go. He, he won't be in the battle, but he'll be in the post game interview. Uh, oh, we got Collector boy. here. I wish my screen would go brighter. Oh, it's getting there. Collector. He's the chaplain of the IVB. Uh, also, Colonel. Uh, say some inspirational words before you. Collector. Collector. Okay, he's just making sure, you know, the devil ain't looking about, right? You know, I don't know where... Look, I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. I don't know where the fuck he's going. This I don't know is, This is, like, just pure... <laughs> just off. did a 360 there. <laughs> Trying to get his bearings. Um, he took a little bit of a prayer there. Yeah, he's... That's what that was. We're, um... Oh, no. Turtling? This again? Didn't we talk about this? Didn't... Wasn't there, like, a lengthy conversation no. about... Something like no, okay, cool. Never. Well, let's have it now. We've never so turtling, guys. Turtling. <laughs> what is turtling, and why is it better than tortoising? Well, look, I'll tell <laughs> What's you what. Tortoising? Look, the hard, the harder shells. I don't fucking know. The harder shells makes it really hard to penetrate the shell. <sighs> I can't keep doing this. Look, you're just giving up more ground, and this is not going to be good for CSA. I don't know what to tell you, dog. I mean, killer <laughs> is absolutely going to plug in his killer instincts Caref here and try to take an attack on killer. end. Right oblique up here. See, like five. Right oblique. What about that officer right there? Oh, yeah, a lot of I, they probably can't it hard see to it. see. Hard to see through all the. Why, why can't they see everything that we see? I know. Like, haven't Sometimes they made hacks for this part. shit? Yeah. Oh, oh okay. Good. That was another Dude, show. after he was dead? Yeah. Sure did. Uh, well, he's. Oh, this guy again. Did he. I, I, I heard, I heard. I know he was level 100. He definitely yeah. hit someone. He definitely hit. Why would a yeah. level 100 person miss? JD is about 20 yards in front of the enemy. A and V is. Look at that. I don't think they know. Brigadier General oh, Pearl Volunteer missed. Pearl. <laughs> <laughs> what a way to go out. What a way, yeah, indeed. More Union coming behind A and V. I don't know if they're gonna assist here. No, they don't care yeah. about A and V. JD though does care oh, about these guys. Who Whoa, is what is this? It is ninth what, is, what is this? And are they? They're definitely trying to locate. Um, JD something here. Um, you know what? I think this is probably the only map that turtling is actually very good because uh, I, I, I don't want to say it's. Uh, I don't. Because it's just so much ground. Now, you're basically, because I don't like it, because you have to double the amount of ground you have to take to actually get to point. You're basically South attacking. Point. And shit like this, you have to know how to turtle. Nobody knows how to turtle. Now you've lost a flag, and you're about to hit taking losses in probably less than five minutes. Which gives you less and less time to counterattack. They do do it successfully. Hey, good job. I can't wait to Who's see it. Officer? But I'm waiting for the day. Who Who's is the this? Officer? Hobson. He's uh, facing a tree. <laughs> it's like, does he What's need going, help? What's going on I inside feel, that head? <gasps> Whoa! I feel like I've got to like talk to him. So he's having a midlife crisis, dude. That, that, <laughs> that ain't normal. You don't look around trees. Want no. to examine the fucking, you know, this ain't bird watching. You know, this is war. Most likely shell shock. Union finally hit the out of bounds. I think CSA pulling out way far out of the out of bounds to prevent 
you know, out of bound charges is good. Team That's the only way turtling works, by the way. We're probably yeah, bro. Yeah, oh, brothers, bro. beans, watch team kill. Yep. We're almost there. I will say this. Um, it has been out. about 15, almost 20, no, 20 minutes now. And it's only engaged, engaged, obviously, uh, CSA on taking losses. I feel like this is probably just about on par. What a shot. A regular match. That was a very good shot. I can't Sorry, believe that. Sorry, I, I, that was just too no worries. Yeah. yeah. Can we see his body? Yeah, it's right there. Wow. Nice of you to finally show up, Kent is on the line. Is this a prayer circle or something? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sorry, no, it's not a shotgun. It's a pale lady and a fucking steel page. What a parade of freaking heroes, bitch. What is going on? This is a busy turtle. This is a busy turtle. This is a busy turtle. They're mad because they're jealous. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> Where did that come from? They can't kill What? Them. How do you how do you just send a random shell that impacts right above yeah, them? That was... That's a really good shot. Six LA celebrating their sixth anniversary. That happened two weeks yeah. ago. But now they're celebrating it. And they're doing a little parade here on the Dunker Church. Um, yeah, wow, Union's I don't actually. Him down. Union is actually very much exposing themselves here because they're all clustered up right there in the middle. Hey, six LA, look, all bullshit aside with this quick timing bullshit. Hey, dude, this might oh, actually yeah. fucking work because all it's the like Union days, is gathered man. up in that little clump in the middle. They have no flanks secured. They have, I mean, kind of. <laughs> no, no, they're not secure. They're just going into the big blob. <laughs> just, they're just merging in to the blob. Union's at least gonna try to knock them down and taking losses. Hope, do I have a beer? Wow. Like, does my character have a beer? No, no, okay. no, no you don't. You're a very, very clean shaven. Dagger. Some of the conversations. Oh my God. Sir, please repeat. Uh, no. Yeah, I live in an apartment. I was, I, I was about to say, if, them, if, if, if he had people in his house, and if I was the first inside that house, I would not be in this game. I really don't like turtles. I should, uh, stop immediately. I kind of like it now. You know what? I've switched. This is, this is better than anything I've ever watched. These are the moments we live for. This is like the red and blue Halo shit that happens in War of I swear to God, you can make a red and blue Halo skit out of this shit, you know? Uh, some of the things that happen in this game and downtime. You just hear shots going off in the distance and you're talking about, you know, sister, I mean, uh, what, what you're going to do the next day and, and whatnot. <laughs> Okay. It's very interesting. Are they still quick timing? No. They've actually gathered up in a large line. Very impressive, actually. That's that's a screenshot right there. Oh let's, yeah, that's let's beautiful. Get one for them. Well, we have time to kill. Yeah, we'll we'll get them the sixth anniversary right there. Beautiful, beautiful. That's a very good one right there. Happy anniversary to the 6LA. Well, we have some downtime right now. And they're going at it. I love that. Perfect timing for this. 6LA does not give a fuck. They're going in. Get up here. Day game. Independent fire. Get your shots off and then disappear back in the woods. Move back. I could not Wee! see shit. Yeah, no, I don't I... even know if they could see shit. But they know they're over I there. I think they're just kind of shit. I mean, those are those probably misses because... What I, they were probably uh, what, are we but here comes Ivy oh my B. gosh Ivy B senses Event. blood in the water they heard a volley very smart for the union to react however it might bite them in the ass I think they just uh, saw it in nothing yeah that's gonna be Better this than... for a while they see the smoke you can see the smoke in the clearing they just refusing to engage because they don't want to give away their position smart by them Indeed. makes it hard for the men to see a very good strategy right there, by the way, kicking up dirt to blind the enemy as well. Oh, of course. I wonder if you got like 300 people to do that, how much dust it would kick up. Like, actually, yeah. You know, you could, like, it's like ninja. It's like throwing pocket sand, you know. Yeah. 
Yeah, that is probably. that is the shittiest quality guitar like pick I've ever heard. <laughs> I have. I don't know what that was. What was that? A bass? I don't know my fucking instruments. <laughs> so I reckon we're gonna see CSA go down to taking losses within the next two, three minutes, probably. I mean, they're so close. Union's bound to hit one or two out of lines, and then they're gonna cap. Cause oh, maybe at this rate, yeah, four, three to four minutes sounds about right. But it's gonna take another eight to ten to get them to. All right, break. Back up. Louisiana, keep this up. Louisiana, up on your feet, about face, rip and back it up just a little. Sorry, Boo, boring man. I, move back, so I know. Everybody <laughs> boos me. <laughs> All right, back to the slide. Back to the slide. Get your loads here, folks. A man of the That's people. That's well deserved. Boo. Nice right here. <laughs> Very self awareness coming out from CSA. Realizing the strategy <laughs> is to sit and wait. I didn't get a Sometimes patience is key. I really hope this plays out for yeah. them because this will be the first time I've seen turtling uh, actually yeah. be effective. But what? See how they handle it. You've never seen I've turtle never... being effective? Yeah, turtling I've, I've, is never, effective sometimes. I've never seen turtling work out in, in most situations. Uh, like, especially the past couple months, I think maybe it used to work at some point, but recently, the past couple months, I think most regiments have actually found out ways to navigate it, whether it be positioning, terrain, depending on the map or knowledge of the map itself. Uh, I think they've, I think they've learned how to navigate it. Certainly in the past recent weeks, uh, that was shown. <laughs> Wednesdays. I mean, yeah, I think we saw a ninth core turtle, which was a stupid turtle. Because there was no way they were going to win that on Piper Farm. Uh, it, while we have downtime, I'll explain what happened. So, it was Piper Farm, uh, Ninth Corps is leading Union. First VA Cav was leading CSA. Ninth Corps capped early in the game. Um, IVB, uh, first, well, IVB, because first VA Cav told IVB to kind of lead the uh, overtime so thing. Because Sevy knows it very well. Let's see what happens here. I think they're just suiciding in like bottom, room, taking losses. Back is this going to be taking losses from right here? No, oh my god. Die. They all die because out of balance. But, um, More are going to die out of line, actually. Yeah. That's about you 20 got tickets. That's a differential, though. But, um, so attackers capped on Piper Farm. Defenders pushed them back out, but they didn't retake the point. The attackers waited till the gold timer hit basically zero. Tried to retake the point, failed to do it because the defenders pre capped. And so it takes a really long time before the recent update to uh, fully get the point back. So then the attackers just sat back in their spawn and just hid when there was infinite overtime because yeah, it, was, it was messy. So turtling did not and, work. It was stupid. And by the way, when they did have the call to finally go for point, they weren't even two minutes away. They were like a good three minutes of sprint, no, full I, sprint. You would run out of sprint with how far they were from point. Yeah, that was the problem too, I, um, among everything. Right? I do not get why. Because here's the thing, right? So when you cap the point, the rules flip, so the attackers are now considered the defenders, and they'll get the last right. stage of last stand. So I don't know why Knife Core turtled there, because eventually you're going to hit last stand and lose the game. Eventually you are. So I I don't know, um, but it's history. They did kind of cut it close, right? right. They they decided to. Really guns. Uh, uh, oh yeah, Jesus, and see, this is why I say turtling is not very necessarily good because now you chat. have to face off yeah. against this shit really this is a four to five position this is the a makeshift if you could stack I mean, logs in game if you could stack limber wood rocks whatever it is that's what they would be doing right now and holy crap these cannons i mean turtling uh, they was because here's the thing if csa could fight in the way they were fighting they were going to lose the game and so they turtled and it forced that black timer to go down a lot. Sure, it's going to be hard to retake this point, but at least it's a different strategy than, the, than just kind of sitting in the open here and losing the fight as an all. It gives you a chance. Sure, it's hard, but that's the point of turtling, um, is you might be losing defending one way. And so by turtling, it kind of resets the boundaries for the match, gives you a different way to play the game and attack. And speaking of which, let's see how the CSA is planning on trying to retake this point. A lot of the CSA Three prong attack. Right. Yeah, some in the center and then some in the far left. Let's look at these two groups, the center and left. 
Um, okay, this is. Oh, I think it's. I think it's friendlies in front of us. Somebody grab it. Delaware. Delaware I don't know. Delaware yeah, and Delaware. Maryland. Uh, is this the other part of so, Sussy? So yep, Delaware so. is taking the center. NC is taking the. Uh, CSA right flank, and I so, guess uh, from what we could do, the six LA take the CSA left, and it, what other company? No, so Sussy Brigade is these two groups here, and then the rest of the CSA is going uh, down this way. Um, these guys are going to get their way before they got to hold up a little bit, unless they're a distraction force. But even then, I think they should try to time things out. Six LA in the front, followed by Hampton's Legion, Hayes Brigade. You also have a JD and Fifth DA. Shots being engaged. Uh, it looks like 5th NC is engaging with the uh, A and V and HD. Yeah. That's a really good position oh, for Union. They have to get shot through two fences, um, but they're very susceptible to get flanked from the woods. I'm not sure about the call to hold on that fence, to be honest. You can't see it. it, it do you understand how hard it is to actually see things in a shaded area of a woodland, you know, uh, map? Like, it's it makes it very hard to tell where they are and if CSA just postures up and, and sits in that wood line well they can stay relatively hidden for the most part when I uh, led last week Friday I think it was on um, Colquitt CSA had this big line on the edge of the woods inside the woods and you couldn't see them there was so much smoke and it was dark and trees that was just like hail bullets in that direction and hopefully we win we didn't win um, oh yeah but Confederate taking losses not really a whole lot though Nine and a half minutes. CSA has spent almost three minutes now moving, and here they come. The masses out of the woods. I'm so glad they did not go. I'm glad and, and sad at the same time they didn't charge the center into the three cannons. <laughs> We're just sitting there. <laughs> this is smart by the CSA. I think 100%. definitely the right maneuver. Uh, concentrating on one flank yeah, while having an auxiliary over, forces to probe yeah, attacks in the center right. and the other side. Right, JD, right. So ninth New York oh. repositioning here. Wow, what a shot. The hole in the fence. Beautiful. Right. They're actually going to ignore that Union group to the left. As they, sh they shouldn't worry about them. Their objective yeah, is to get up cool there and retake this point. Might have time to turn those cannons. Maybe still use them. Turn the cannons around. Man, look, I'm not going to lie. I don't know why they didn't take the closest point of contact, which would be from more closer to the woods, because now they have to go... They, You're going to get two shots off, maybe three shots uh, off this charge. But CSA still actually has a substantial force. They're going down. The front line actually goes down. Shots going down left and right. American flags waving nice and high. Caissons are blocking the path a little bit. More charge. shots are coming out for the Union. God damn. Charge happening in the distance as well. A lot of CSA on top, though. They're kind of spread out here. I like how the Union used the caissons to extend this uh, snake fence. There's the gun. That smoke is not going to be good for the Union. That's More a lot of CSA smoke that you can't in. see. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Who is that holding the canister? <laughs> Poor guy. Right oh, wait, by the it's American kind of flag. a makeshift wall too. Awesome. It is a makeshift wall. CSA. Only big only big enough for one person to get through at a time. CSA might actually win this, unbelievably so. There's still oh. a lot of union, but still good amount of oh. CSA. Oh, I think Union's gonna win this. I have no idea, to be honest, I think. It was pretty even. Uh, Close to the unit behind. It is pretty even. Oh, my God. It is incredibly even right now. Metal stepping up to the plate, showing them the metal actually goes down. Flags going down left and right for the Union. Still more shots popping off. People, CSA holding their rifle butts above the air to try and Crap. fortify some type of attack. Union getting charged Union's, in the rear. Union's going to lose this. Crap. Union that, uh, trying actually, to consolidate. No one's won yet. They wiped no. that group behind, and now the Union guys can all focus in one direction. But CSA's got three spec. Hey! Wow! Hey. Wow! wow. That wiped me. nearly wow. everyone. That won it for Union. Du that the, won that fight for the Union. You know what? Absolutely it did. Artillery finally contributing to the Union cause tonight. That, that was, was like that was, a that was 30 shot. people, at least, right? Like no more, no, no less than wow. 20. No way, dude. I would be so mad if I was the Confederates. You're winning this charge. You got a good shot of holding, and then just artillery came in. 
just cap the Kang right now? Uh, it very, it's decaying, it's natural though. That's really unfortunate. However, this is still CC is yeah. still in good position. Yeah, but also too, that. that's why you kinda have to keep moving. Um All right, yep. no, we, we can do it. We can do it. We got the numbers to jump cap if we jump this fence right side, fellas. So once we're loaded, we'll go making the call to take this attack on end. Very valiant of him. He's reading the situation, sees that the union is so, yeah. well, actually reinforced, so <laughs> <laughs> never mind. Um Go LA, ahead. I would hold off on that call, I would think. Maybe look back around the corner. Yeah, Things have changed in the past ten seconds. That's gonna hurt. But again, it doesn't matter because they cap point. But Wow. This is very impressive. Uh, I've never seen Duncan Church played this way. Um, wow, the union's got a firm gold hold. CSA yeah, reforming. This is going to take a while for them to reform. CSA's maybe got a good one, maybe two charges. Most likely one charge. Some guys in the Dunker Church. Federated breaking. Not a, that doesn't mean a whole lot. Stop, stop, stop out of the way. Step out of the way, Cloud. He missed. Maybe. Yeah. I think Extra crispy. Does, does, does not care. He does not give a fuck. It, wow, that's an album cover. Friendly, 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 friendly. That is absolutely an album cover. <laughs> wow. Where's the War of Rights what? remix what? drop? Battle Line Network rap battles now coming to you live on Spotify. Rap Subscribe. Battle, epic rap battles of history. Of history. Savvy so. versus any artillery person. Yeah, literally, <laughs> literally anyone that gets put. Yeah, dude. You know. <laughs> Uh, CC hit breaking. I guess we missed that at some point because, uh, well, I don't know. They were kind of both dead and there was a whole lot of huzzahs. But yeah, so they hit breaking. Uh, this flank coming out. I guess that was 6 LA now kicking up to gear. They're actually going to take this right prong attack. Killer is trying to move his men to the left. It's going to be too little, too late, I think. CC is going to go up to this fence line. Union hitting, taking losses. Jesus Christ. They notice just in time. They notice. Yeah, holy in crap! Time. They're all pouring that's, in now. Uh, that's a lot. Uh, that might be an overcommitment right here. What's going on in the other flanks? For this to be going on, how many reserves can you actually commit? Nothing. Oh no! Another attack. Actually, they. they this was coordinated. Uh, for sure. <laughs> for, for sure, definitely coordinated. Wow, this is a really yeah. good sweep. This is. Didn't I say this in the beginning to do this? Right, cut the. You know, yeah. closest path, right? The and now they're they doing be. it, and now they won the center, it, right? Is that not what happened? Yeah. Right. Oh, Artillery, <laughs> there we go again. Uh, but Union's talking. gonna start repositioning over here. Um, oh no! That artillery shot. Is... Pileti's charge or this charge on the right? They need to be synced up. It's it's. I they would have done so much better if they were synced up. Because the Union overcommitted on Pialetti's push. Um, a, little bit of, a little bit of teleportation there. Yes, yeah. he's definitely going to lose this fight. So they took the center. Uh, lost their flags in the process. But they lost the battle. Um, at least yeah, this no, little skirmish. Goes down to Alaska. <laughs> okay, the good old. I'm gonna just drop through the earth. What is that? Is it fucking quicksand or something? <laughs> He's like, nope, I'm done. <laughs> he stepped on a patch of quicksand, or maybe some uh, boiled sugar. Jesus. Hello, sir. Thanks for five. Oh, well, okay. okay, he also stepped in some quicksand. That guy, by the way, extra, he was there the entire time. Behind you, behind you, in the forest. <laughs> you do not say that in God's house, my man. That is not what you. I was. What? 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 I missed it. Oh yeah. <laughs> what? Okay, final push. This is the last. Their last shot, I think. Game. They need to go one now. No. They need to go the now before Union reinforces. They have to, otherwise it is over. They know they can't take them in a in a in a, in a good fight. Why is there a better them reinforced? Is that? Wait, I saw it too. All right, no. just go, just go no. win the match. <laughs> is this the five just stages go. of grief? Bargaining? Oh, hello. What are you guys yeah. doing over here? Open. 
what? What are you doing? I, I see me a rebel. Yeah. Well, just worry, go win. We, we I see me a rebel. Just, just go win. Just go win. Just go win. Keep hiding over, we over here. We don't want to be here. Let's see. Well, are right, they going to commit to an attack kill. finally? Yeah, oh, we're one of you. Go win. Come on. <laughs> this is more Do important it. than go the in. battle. Go win. Go win. Ah, it's so tough. more important than the battle. What is happening? I see stars all over there. Poor, I'm poor there, so it looks uh, like those guys were auto balanced over. over, anyways. Guess I'm the nick of time. Finally, the commitment of an attack. They're actually gonna fully stack this left side. I think this is actually pretty smart as Union is, is gonna fall down left and right. Holes in the fence line are being exploited by the CSA. Shots going down left and right. Flags are trying to maintain their bearings, but they're actually gonna climb over. CSA still has a substantial force on this, on this fence line. They're actually gonna just go for point. Union is gonna be forced to attack here. Wow! I can like a CSA win and... No. I think Only CSA might have actually done it the right way this yep, time. They're as winning. There's a good amount. They're winning. Ladies and gentlemen, we ha oh come on, no, 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 no. We have overtime. <laughs> so, in theory, the CSA shouldn't cap here and just push up to here and force the Union into last stand. Yeah. Theoretically, because CSA very much won that fight. But I, but guys, the flag, dude. Kill that fucking flag bearer, man. Why is he running in the Why battle? Why is he running back? <laughs> you deserve that. Oh. Ouch. That killed at least 10 of them. It was close. The shrapnel is actually very deadly. Sometimes you don't notice the shrapnel. Uh, specific people. But that are, these artillery shots are all in vain. This does not matter at all. They're going to cap point, and honestly, I wouldn't blame them because as good as the overtime strategy is, um, you take what you can get, and I believe it's too much of a risk to undertake at this point. Yeah, Man. I mean... What, what's, Hats what's, off to the fucking CSA. Never mind, he's over 100. He's got immunity. He, wants to go he knows get what service. he's doing. He, he knows what he's doing. Hey, that was meant to happen. Ghoul here... Level 38, doesn't know what he's doing. Why is he retreating? Uh, Todd Gray knows what's up. Anyway, 17 minutes left. Both sides taking losses. The CSA is basically about to go into breaking. So, yeah, Union's got a pretty dang good shot at winning this. And there's no reason why they shouldn't win. Oh, yeah. No reason at all as breaking is going to be very hard to defend against. CSA entirely needs to rethink their strategy of how they're going to go about this. Um, part two. Kids, four kids, four kids. They're not turtling. They're gonna hit breaking. Yeah, yeah. they will. It's it's too risky to turtle right now. Absolutely. Crawford wants to knock him down. Come on, Crawford, do it. Do it, you fucking. Yeah, there you go. No, almost. I got nine. So let's see what the CSA is cooking up here. Let him cook. Um. Cooking indeed. Some CSA holding out in the back of the woods. Most of them kind of surrounding this church. Some holding the nipple. I mean, at this point, I mean, holding for 16 minutes is going to be rough. you got to knock them in the final push. They, I don't get holding behind that church, man. It's such a death trap. Oh, they're, they're, they're the taking the cannons. Around. Turn the cannons around. Union. Oh, wow. What a beautiful shot. Union cascading over the ridge line into a big musket fire from the CSA, I think. I don't actually know where they're necessarily lined up but that's a beautiful shot coming out union now trying to do all they can a cannon actually goes off into the rear line csa now forming up on the fence like it's a scene from a movie gettysburg now as union gets absolutely slaughtered they're trying though they actually make it to the fence csa is pouring it on musket fires are overlaying each other they're going to be Both able to hold maybe breaking. Wow. Here we go. A lot of Union went down in that initial attack. CSA, a good majority, are now getting payback for the Fallen Brothers right here. Yeah, and there you go. The Fighters God. demolished them. I'll be sure to stay on a ray here next. I don't know. I got to find a I gotta find a good angle, angle for this next push. Because there's just so much smoke in the center there. Wow, that was, that was beautiful. Uh, and Union's losing... Union might be oh, losing on tickets here in a moment. All of their flags. 
all out of lines. Officers going down. Flags trying to hold on to their colors, trying to get them back to the line. Major I, I Sim, guess, run, I don't know. Run back to your spawn. What are you doing? Why do they, why what are you do doing? Flag bears do you this, doing? dude? Is picking up a flag like a minus 20 IQ buff or something? You know, like, do you just, like, lose brain cells picking up a flag? Yes. <laughs> Ouch. That's gonna hurt. Nope, never mind. Well, that guy died. It's funny, too, because if that cannon would have a shot, uh, when the Union was, that would have killed so many Union. <laughs> that would have killed the entire charge. Like, actually, it would have. If that was a little bit 10 seconds earlier, but... Union has recovered good, one flag. That is the situation right now. They are trying to regroup. CSA... Uh, honestly, they probably lost about 20% of their men. Um, and Union lost about 90. And that, that's rough to see. Union just gotta knock it. I mean, Union has 14 minutes to work with. Union's down on tickets. Um, but, I mean, they're still pretty dang eating. Uh, they have a good shot here, Dit. Why are you guys doing this? Who is this? Uh, uh, Who is, is this? I do not agree with this why at are, all. No, they're splitting themselves apart, and Union can push up and wipe. I mean, uh, oh, it's the no. whole team. It's the whole team. This is a coordinated attack. Goodness gracious. Well, in that case, this might actually change the situation, but I still don't agree with it, to be honest. They're retreating. Come up. Come up. I think a few men there are wavering. That guy got absolutely clotheslined by something. He I don't really know. did. Jesus. Some of the Union is that a push? Is that a push? Are they crescent? No. Officers are wow. just scouting. That's what that is. Okay. I do not agree with this. You are low it's, on time. I think they're just trying to avoid artillery fire. Maybe. But then again, you are exposing the right side of your line. A exhibit okay. A. Wow. You know but what? I, I honestly... You know what? Fine. I... Uh, yeah, Union's playing this well. Wow. They're forcing the CSA to go back out, and we could see JD here, HL, Sussy. CSA is starting to pull off here. No, don't turn your back to the enemy. You're just going to get shot in the back. Union actually crests that hill, and they're firing into the rear. Into the rear. Damn. Union is actually going to take an attack on end on the center. As Union firing from afar on the left flank. This is going to be a hard fought battle right here. This this is just a grudge match. This is a like an absolute sluggish piece of warfare that we are witnessing here. There goes Union Artillery. Ticket wise, yeah. it's still about dead even. Maybe a little bit of a lead to Union, but still too close to It's way too close to call. Wow. The decision to go one server tonight, a uh, good decision. You don't see many 300 man battles anymore. No. It's always nice when you get them. Tickets on this actually might break the record because that overtime and, you know, extra 10 minutes might have gained CSA a lot of casualties. We're, we're looking at over 3,000 casualties here, possibly, maybe 2,500. Definitely heavy shot. More Union artillery trying to pelt that position right now. I, I don't. I still don't agree with that CSA. Now it's only one Union. company, so I definitely don't agree with that. Um, uh, Union's winning on tickets here. They sure are. Again, still pretty close. But Union now bolstering their forces on that fence line, uh, on that hill, I should say. Yikes. This is interesting. It's definitely going to be close. Uh, CSA is... Oh! Yeah. Ricochet. You know, the fact that a video game like this can have 300 man servers is what is insane, first of all. And this is even more insane. JD, what are that's, they doing? That, they want to hit game. last stand. That's game. That's game. If JD commits to this attack and they send everybody, that's... It's game over. CSA is going to hit last stand within 30 seconds from this. As JD men are falling, not really taking many down, or at least they're trying to. Yikes. One JD guy left. Is that going to get him? Nope, sure yeah, isn't. Close. They still got a little bit of a chance. I, uh... I, I... Wow. The fact I can't that this believe, game I can't believe I watched man. that. <laughs> 300 men, yeah. You know, it's, it's crazy. Like, seeing 300 man servers in a game, I've never seen a game even get close to 300. And we take it for granted. Yeah, but this is this is worth it. Wow. Yeah. Can't On the test servers during big updates, especially during the artillery one, it got up to 
400 at some point and it ran fairly well there rightfully we so 40 seconds exactly on the 10 minute mark Union from when we had down. predicted there we go but um hey. the only concern is right is 300 player 400 player it's great when you have those like that many players online but all the times when it's not that like if you have a 400 man server and you have 300 like 300 people on having only one ser public server to show that could make the game look more dead than if you had smaller server sizes like hell at loose for example but obviously hell at loose has more of a fan base um, yeah but oh well it is what it is yeah, great I think game it definitely game. adds to the intensity you know just having a server full of fucking people you know it's like a club an exclusive club you gotta gain access csa is gonna pull off this church to try and conserve as many tickets as they can try to brace this attack and you know what you know what i think csa has a good chance of winning this if union pushes up and they're able to repel the charge that is the only and literally only situation that they're going to be able to win a union attack so is actually these being men do not want to live anymore um killer some jd guys more jd guys i mean yeah, they just so imagine Legion Knight getting sniped by Pure Fist. Hey, come back. They ran away. Wow. They are cowards. Clear these up. That is the devastating shot on the instant replay. Union, Union's gonna have final push very soon. Oh, yeah. But Union's taking this corner here. Point is natural decay right now. Probably going to deploy skirmishers to try and take point. They see CSA is not actually on it. I, so they might commit three guys to it, try to cap it, bait them out. It's as uh, simple as that, to be honest. That cannon somehow flipped in the center, by the way. Uh, it's uh, we got a hole in the line, lads. All right, here comes CSA. Oh, uh, here we go. They're going they to tried the line same line. attack strategy as last time, but there's not going to be as much union. However, they are caught in a crossfire, trying to cross over the hill. CSA is absolutely going to clump up here, which is going to be their demise, as now union attacks them from the flank. All CSA is concentrated on that fight. Union, union hits final push. Four minutes. Four minutes on the clock. The union's got this in the bag. Sure do. Union has so infinite well. tickets. Infinite tickets overpowered, some might say. Um, and this might actually be game right here. Although it doesn't look like Union actually has that many more men on point. Uh, this looks like a, a pretty even brawl if that is the correct choice of what, whatever the fuck is going on yeah, here. Yeah, brawl is a word. Just bodies dropping left and right. Flags going down again, trying to wave high I to noticed. signify some sort of rallying point for the guys. But it's it's a scattered fight. And it's safe to say Union is absolutely going to take the Dunker Church from the CSA hands. Yeah, only a couple guys left. Tagre guiding the flag around. Um, well played, going down. Oh, a heck of a game. Yeah, well, well, well deserved win for Union after the last game. Some payback there, but I believe CSA played that as best as they could. Well, okay. No, not really, but you know. Oh no. <laughs> Quick scoped. That guy has a concussion too. He's going home. What a shot. Wow. What a what a thrilling event tonight. That, yeah, that was that great. was that was really this honestly, and I'll say this right now as Guardian and Shade, this was probably one of the best events I've probably ever commentated on. And that's game. Game goes down, seven minutes on the clock. <laughs> CSA loses the fight as someone is just laughing in their death. I don't know, Ghosts of Antietam. Is that what this campaign is called? <laughs> we're here at Ghost, baby. Good shit. Wow. So, Fuse, your thoughts for the, the round? If you have any more? Yeah, that's, uh, you know, obviously a good game. I'm not going to reiterate that. Very well played. But, man, if CSA just simply wasn't that... I, I, I don't get being aggressive. Look, there's, there's a time and a place. Uh, for the aggression. I saw JD being very much aggressive all the time. I don't know if, you know, that was on their own decision or what, but just based off analytical reasons, it's not the right move. And I believe we saw why that was the case tonight, but good job. After that turtling, everything played pretty much as per part on that second attack. 
Wow. Oh, the, the casualties. casualties. Confederacy, they lost by one point. Shade, your thoughts for this round? Uh, honestly, I always hate the team, the Turtles, so I'm just happy the CSA or the USA won that <laughs> round. Uh, <laughs> but um, other than that, yeah, well, good strategy for the Union there. And with that being said, we'll see you in the post game interview. Here we are with the post game interview for tonight's NA Sunday night event. It was exciting. 300 man server. You don't see that too often. And it was a thriller. Uh, two great rounds. Schoolhouse Ridge on the first round. CSA pretty much thoroughly dominated that whole game. Pretty impressive. And then Dunker Church Union played, played very impressively. Uh, we did see a turtle, but regardless, Union won in the end. So we have leaders to talk about strategy and more. So let's go through and introduce everyone. So we're going to go through the Union side first. First, we've got Killer. Uh, hi, I am the, the anti-turtle, one might say, Colonel Killer, the ANV. Got Hazard. Yeah, call me Turtle Man, yee yee, live action. <laughs> we got Ninja. We got Ninja, a.k.a. Turtle Slayer. <laughs> Thank yeah, you. So, and then the pro turtling side, CSA side. Uh, first, we got hey. Jay. Uh Second Lieutenant Jay of the First Delaware. Uh, go ahead and check out the First Delaware's merch brought to you by Battle Line Network. Thank you. It's it's pretty beautiful. It looks great. Uh, next we got Carl. Oh, uh, okay. Carl's AFA. <laughs> Thank Carl you, Carl. Is gone. Uh, next we got Crumfy. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck. Push talk. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> You're good, Carl. Who are you? Yeah, uh, other return from Delaware or other second lieutenant, whatever you want to call me. Del I'm Delaware's resident. Delaware's resident retard. And I was leading that event for Delaware, so ye. Thank you. Oh, that's why. Next, we got the one and only Crumfy making your return. Drag C Murphy, aka C Problems Fix Em, C Turtles. <laughs> I'm a. I'm a. I, yeah, listen. Yeah, C Murphy, fifth and C. Major. Problems oh, yeah. mixing. AC's a fucking menstrual cycle with some of this shit going we on. We got right here. Lady Slayer. Hey guys, it's Fuse. Uh, I'm a hard shell turtle type of guy. Said, and uh, you know, something Hughes. about being hard. No, soft Hughes. shell. And, Hughes. And, uh, <laughs> he said Hughes, not Fuse. Yeah, Hughes, Fuse, same thing. <laughs> he said hard shell <laughs> turtle. <laughs> Hughes. <laughs> okay, yeah, sorry. Uh, second Lieutenant Hughes, um, First Corps Missouri State Guard, First Missouri Light Infantry Regiment. Uh, we got Doug. What's up, guys? Captain Doug of the Fifth NC. Bucky Killer. We got Zapstar. <laughs> Captain Zapstar, First Maryland, uh, resident anti turtle of the CSA tonight. <laughs> uh, Pearl, would you like to join this? Yeah, uh, sure. Yeah. Uh, he said Pearl uh, Carl. Turtles. <laughs> Let him go. not Carl. <laughs> Fuck yeah, turtles. Yeah. Put more plastic in the ocean. Carl, he said Pearl. Hey, Carl. Pearl, if you'd like to introduce yourself, he was on the union tonight. Yeah, uh, volunteer Pearl, a.k.a. Laurente Rollins, a.k.a. Neff Finkelberg, represent a and V. Thank you. And then your announcer team tonight, there was myself as Guardian Eagle, and then we also have Fusewall Jackson. Oh, 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 now it's my, oh, oh. Oh, I thought you said Hughes Wall Jackson. Because, you know, I, I thought that was like the guys. Uh, hey, guys, it's uh, Second Lieutenant Hughes with the MSG. I'm a state guard for Missouri because I live in fucking Missouri, babes. What's going on? I'm a hard shell turtle type of guy, but I like soft too. And there we go. Oh, Thank you all for being here. Yeah. Oh, I thought something was Anyways, let's go to the first round. Schoolhouse Ridge CSA is attacking, so we'll start with you guys. Uh, what was your guys' strategy to attack the Squash Ridge, and how did you guys react to the battlefield? Brigades. Okay, I'll go. So our strategy was to, to push down the right side, take the tree. You know, it was hard fought. They they almost stopped us, sort of, and then, you know, eventually we got it. And they were, you know, we were moving. It's your typical schoolhouse. Feel it out. Take the point when you have to, you know, try to whittle them down. That's what we did. We took the point. We managed to hold it. And it was a it was a pretty clean effort. So we got it done. That was it. Nice. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> first Maryland stuck close with fifth NC the entirety of the uh well for the majority of the first map. Uh later we kind of split off a bit. Uh once uh we firmly held point, we kind of positioned ourselves to the Confederate left in the woods, hoping to counter Union forces that are charging down towards our left and hit them right in the side. We did so on two occasions successfully and wiped the enemy assault. And then Delaware, we kind of just sat on the right after we took it, uh, doing volleys and independent fire up onto the hill and the Union spawn. Uh, we eventually sat in the creek and cat point, and then uh, we just kind of stuck around on point, uh, shooting them down, repelling charges, and doing some charges ourselves. How did it feel to sit in that water, Jay? Huh? Oh, it was, how, it was how did it feel nice and cool. And, uh, it was very refreshing. Very oh, yeah? Refreshing. Oh, is that right? Did you see any turtles uh, huh? over there? Uh, no? no, actually, I think we squished a few. Okay. Well, that's all my questions. So. <laughs> no fucking no turtles. Now. Okay. Well, any other CSA? Uh, I'll, I'll tell you what MSG did. We just kind of went right with the entire thing. Sat there, you know, they kind of fell back. Well, me and the boys are each other like, that's kind of boring, so we kind of shifted left when second core went so we have someone to protect us of sorts and then we just kind of boogalooed them as they would charge and you know sit in that creek and had a little fun well uh, said yes and, i love reading the memoirs of longstreet during the gettysburg attack you know when they got boogalooed by the union i was uh oh, i love reading that sentence <laughs> thank you <laughs> uh I think that was on CSA. Was that everywhere? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Oh, All yeah, right. Anything else to add? Oh, oh. Uh, aside from the general uh, neuron activation, that was my brain <laughs> first map. Uh, yeah. Uh, fun. Had a lot of fun charging. Thank you, Carl. Cool. You're, you're uh, welcome. That was, that, that was all I did. <laughs> that's, that's all we did. We just charge point. Held point. Order. There, there was a reason why I was babysitting him in They're on activation. Today. Keen observation. Important. So, let's good. move on to the USA defense. What was your guys' strategy to defend Squaws Ridge, and how did you guys react to the battlefield? Uh, well, I want to refer to Ninja for this, okay, because, you know, he was a real key part of our strategy. He kind of put it in place, you know, everybody go left. And then he fucked off to the CSA first map. I didn't fuck off. I balanced the <laughs> server, as so, is my duty as a <laughs> server admin. So, so, um, yeah, the plan was to have everybody on the left. It, 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 oh, something fell through, but <laughs> was, wasn't, the, wasn't the plan. <coughs> that, that well, I didn't even have an officer spot on USA. Um, but yeah, the plan was to all go left, hold by the tree, and repel them as they came up. We held for about five minutes, and then we got repelled. So then, from then on, it was. You sure it was five uh, minutes? Are you are you overcompensating there? Perhaps about five minutes. It was a know? good bit. They held them. I'd say yeah, about <laughs> maybe, maybe like four. It took us a little longer. Than I'd say I'd say three. <laughs> four forty-seven. Three, three shot my ass in the face sooner. As are we? Are we fucking sooner? Are we fishermen now? Are we and then preparing we, the fucking time? And then we, you know, went went to the right. And then you didn't turtle. Then, then we tried to count at the point. Cat point. Um. Yeah, we counted point, and failed. Did it again, and failed, and that was it. Really, it was very straightforward. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start crying here in a second, Killer. Yeah, the, that's a very uh, somber tone. I mean, pizza. Killer, was it you that we kept catching the side as he advanced towards point? <laughs> I uh, don't know. Out on the far uh, Union right, CSA left. It was a lot of sussy A and V engagement happening over there. <laughs> <laughs> sure was. <laughs> just uh, witnessed yeah. me just get creamed by artillery, just standing I on my rock. There, there was quite a bit of uh, friendly fire tonight with CSA. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, just... yeah. Schoolhouse Ridge Union gives me small bass. <laughs> no, I, you know, we, we, we tended to hold that left, but as soon as CSA got to that fence, that bucking ball hurts. Like, the, fuck the Artie. The Artie wasn't doing that much damage. But that bucking ball. Man, yeah, I think, I think CSA's Artie was doing more damage to CSA than, than <laughs> Union Artie no was tonight. 
Yeah, and once you're once you're knocked off and you're hemmed in by Artie and they've capped point, like that's just a just a lost cause of a map for for the Union. You're relying on CSA to completely fuck up, and I don't think Sussy Brigade's gonna fuck up that hard. Oh, thanks. thanks. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah I, I vouched for you. You've obviously never guys out of 150. I might be yeah. rest yeah, you've, would be fine. You've obviously never shared a Steam chat with them. Hi. <laughs> hey, our, our, Steam, I think I'm our, pretty Steam chats, our Steam chats can be quite civil at times. Quite. It's because Zoo's not here this weekend. I do want to cut everyone's quiet. balls here for a second, though, and say Union Steam chat was really, really smooth. Huzzah. For, for like being nine people in there. Because we didn't turtle, I would have. I would have went off the fucking rails, dude. We just didn't I let you. switch sides. <laughs> Look, guys, just for BLM, we do not condone any violence against actual turtles. Here, okay, like you know, all turtles Good are point. created equal, and you know what? This is why we have amendments in the Constitution. Look, guys, take care of your turtles. Wait, wait, what, what amendment? Next map, please. Yeah, next map. <laughs> yeah, next map. Any, anyone else on the on the USA want to say anything? Um, I hated that first map. <laughs> uh, my guys balanced twice in that map. Um, thank you to them for their patience and doing the right thing to make it fun for everybody. I like turtles. Oh, God. I have, I have one question. Why did so Union went down to the right? I think it was three times to try to retake the point. Why didn't you guys try to go down the left side? Artillery. Fair right, enough. but. But if you would have charged where they were, then their artillery would have had to shoot. I mean, our, our, guys, our so. artillery was already shooting okay, our guys. Okay, fair. But that's that. That's what we call in psychology an outstanding outlook. I don't, I don't know. It's like, I don't fucking... But yeah, Union artillery was really hammering you guys. That's a fair point. I stayed up on top of the berm. And so I seen all the uh, CSA groups moving around. I didn't, I didn't think everyone was closer to the left side. You get a much better rundown as Union running all the way to the right. I see. That's fair. Much more majestic running downhill to the right. Um, I had a question in terms of the counterattack. Um, whoever wants to answer for the Union, uh, why didn't you? Why didn't you guys decide to charge their side of the fence instead of being just on the other side of the fence, trying to stab each other through wooden posts and and whatnot? What was the uh? What was the you idea behind on that? On the way, on the way in, easier from, from that side. I think. I mean, I, I don't know exactly. Fair. <laughs> Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. We need to start using like political answers to these questions. We <laughs> might you know, not actually answer don't the side. question, but answer the question. I don't actually know the answer. I'm making a guess. Oh, because you know things. Uh, guesstimation is always often always correct. Amen to that. Killing now, why didn't you? Now, now, why didn't you guys You're turtle? To trick me into giving something away. Sure, am. we don't. Sure, we don't am. need your strategy playbook, Ninja. Please explain. Every strategy, <laughs> every map. My only plan is to improvise. I that, 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 that's, that's a good plan. plan. That is, yeah. that is a good plan. plan. A plan uh, to improvise, huh? So with that, let's move to the second round. Dunker Church Union was attacking, so we'll start with you guys. What was your strategy to attack with Dunker Church, and how did you guys react to the battlefield? Kill the turtles. Well, we, uh. <laughs> what sound does a turtle make? Do they make ah! Aside from their dying noises? Yeah, there we go. The, uh. <laughs> we intended to send two prongs really close together. One up Victory Hill, one up the fence. Take the nipple, hold the nipple, swing our dicks around at the nipple. Well, CSA did, uh, did that really fucking funny thing of running down into the woods right side out in the field so that kind of that kind of screwed with that plan a little bit but we wiped them pushed them back into the woods and eventually they went in the woods they went back in the back we followed them people uh tall gray was running back and forth and out of bounds shooting at them we capped we were trying to suicide charge and put them into taking losses when a uh so we'd have them in taking losses in a shorter cap timer we were like a couple of kills off when hd was wiped doing that Well, yeah, you just shoot them. Get up to the spot, shoot them when they come out of the woods. It's very simple. Fascinating. Yeah, it was like 
the, the plan kind of worked. Like, the middle group took the nipple within the first, like, charge with no resistance. The group on the right had a bit more, bit more problems. Uh, there was a lot of CSA over there. But I think once we had the nipple, we were kind of just secure in the center. And, yeah, it was nice. Carl, is that you on your profile picture? Yes, that yes, is actually Carl. it is Pickle Carl. Oh, nice. You're anyway. a Pickle. Moving on. Yeah, um, Pickle yeah, Carl. Uh, it was a case of them when they were turtling at the back. It was, when do we want to cap? Do you want to leave us enough time? Do you want to try and suicide more? And we decided just to cap and do a nice big defense on the, on the, on the point. And we did that. And we held it for a good two charges. And then the third one, you know, third one's the, the lucky, what's the same? Third time's the charm. Third time's the charm. Oh, something like that. And yeah, we got pushed off. Yeah, well, that's fascinating. Killer. Anyways, on to Carl. Uh, hey, Carl, is that really you and your profile picture? I really want to hammer yeah. this home because yeah. this is, yeah, this is what, uh, you more important. Yeah, you have seen memes? No, I have no, not. No, because uh, the Carl memes, Carl reaction? Oh, Jesus, Carl memes are more so contained to <laughs> Delaware. I'm sorry I asked. <laughs> Anybody else? Uh, any other comments from the union for the first round or second round? Ah, time flies. You're having fun. Second round. Any other union comments? It's fun. Uh, I think, um, regardless of what the actual strategy behind turtling is, its effectiveness on winning, you should always keep in mind that there's 300 players in the server. It's Sunday night. Most of them are drunk, and to try to get them to turtle. They're not having as much fun as they would just like get out there and, and play the game, guys. That makes a lot of sense because we saw a lot right. of weird All shit right. going on in the woods. Yeah, um, you could. It's a, it's the a mic. possible winning strategy. I, I think some. Pe I think some people passed out drunk or something. One hundred and fifty people pa passed, passed sit the there mic. and do nothing. Passed, passed the mic. Trumpy, Trumpy, it's the USA's Trumpy, turn. It's your. It's, it's my USA turn, team. buddy. You had your turn. Yeah. I did it. What? Are you, you will have your turn. turn. I'd just like to say, <laughs> MSG, we got our walks in because we switched to Yank as soon as <clears throat> as soon as the Reds went back there and did a circle jerk or whatever they were doing back there. And we we we, we were just like soccer moms walking around that field. We got we got our steps in. That's all that matter. Then we killed some Reds on the side. Amen. E brother. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's that's all. <laughs> all right. Wait, Are you so sure? Did anyone else outside of MSG switch? Second round? PA switched. PA switched? Okay. Oh, PA, you glorious, selfless bastards. Ah, oh, amazing. Thank you. That's going in the PA promo video. Absolutely. He's is. well as excited about this PA promo video. You may I or am. may not hear him yell PA very loud on the middle of this. We podcast. have our own promo video. Shows, Dude, I, like, I'm so excited for you guys. Scantily clad women in really nice cars. And <laughs> don't get either one if you join. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Can you send me that again? Uh, sure. Killer just abdicated the A and B. But, anyways, <laughs> uh, CSA defending on Dunker Church, what was your strategy and how did you guys react to the battlefield? Trumpy. <laughs> oh, okay. You want me to go? Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. So, I don't know about the overall. I mean, it, like, Ninja was saying, yeah, we have 150 people. It's kind of like, all right, let's just kind of spread them out along this lane, you know, shift where we need to be. For the Sussy Brigade, we were positioned in the center to kind of swing where we needed to go. There was some lack of communication all around. That's just how it is. And then ultimately, because of that, the, because it was bad, we ended up telling everybody to pull back right pull back into the woods we're losing tickets quickly let's just reestablish ourselves and yeah that is that is a turtle right we it's ultimately up to the attackers to do something about that you know we're going to regroup we want them to cap the point they didn't have to wait like 15 minutes to cap the point they could have capped it as soon as they realized we were going back drawn us out it, it's it's you know, a, a dual party thing. I get it though. They didn't want to do that. They wanted us to go taking losses first. I've but that's just not how it works. Conversations right. I mean, it's just like it turtle against it, you guys, and and I right. And we capped the point. The the, the mean words it's, you say. It's simple. And, and I echo them. I I've literally never. It. I've never. 
I've never to called be, out. Right. To, to be fair, Murphy, 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 you have been gone quite some time. I have been gone quite some time. But hey, that. back in my day, back in my day, back that's just how it was. You know, people didn't cry about it. If I see somebody turtling, I cap that's the point. True. Make There's them never come been out. A period in War of Rights history where people didn't cry about. All people right, would definitely have that's cried. Right. Nice. But anyway, that our strategy kind of fell apart. But we got our counter charge. We wiped them out. We had a good thing going. And then somewhere along the lines, we decided after we initially kind of broke them off and we got the point back. So somebody suggested that we all go to Victory Hill. That was. And we did right. And I'm just like, you know what? Everyone wants to do it. We're going. Let's do it. We did it. Yeah. Union started uh, shifting left to kind of uh, down the lane. I'm like, that's cool. So then I called for Sussy Brigade to go left for the rest to stay just so that we could uh, kind of mess with them a little bit. And the next thing I knew, the entire team was behind me except for the unfortunate Maryland <laughs> who got Florida. left in Florida, which is like that, you that's know, what you have with Sussie, that's Sussie not right there. nearly. Yeah. So that's like 20 guys. About against like forty. There was if, forty yeah, on there. the other side. Of if that I can hill, jump in there real quick, absolutely. Uh, we were taking minimal casualties and inflicting substantial upon the enemy. And uh, I should not have pulled out per the directive from officer shot. I should have held there until the last man. No doubt. But ultimately, he should, not, he should not. He should not have crazy. been. Yeah, he should not have been left there. Definitely when should have had more around, people. We... That's what turned it for us, honestly. When as soon as you turned around, we we were able to shoot you in the back and get you to last stand, and then it was I knew like, that it, would happen. But all the pressure was on us to do it. It may it I'll, it yeah. may have delayed it. I mean, if they had stayed under, we had people I, all over the place. Once we pulled we off, doing good work there. Yeah, yeah absolutely. No, no, point, guys, like th that was good. Hey, Ninja, this is our. We have the mic. We have the mic. Shut up. No, he, uh, he can praise me all he wants. <laughs> well, I'm, 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 I'm trying. I'm trying to praise Zap oh. in Florida. They they did exactly what they were supposed to do, and I'm just like, man, we were supposed to have more guys down there with them, but like I said, there's just a big lack of communication on that second one. Everybody except for them ended up leaving Victory Hill when it was only supposed to be not even half the team leaving it to repel this this left side push just to kind of stump them and then we kept we got bombarded by artillery because we had so many guys up on the left and by that point it was just too much disarray and too much ticket losses on breaking to bring it back zapstar and them they were holding gloriously under the hill but it it, it was inevitable that we were going to go down to last stand it was just going down quickly because of everyone else so I don't really think that them running back flipped it at all. I mean, it may have no. it may have quickened it by 20 seconds, but it was coming down. It was just going to happen anyway. The Union did a good job pulling us apart with that that little push they did I, I do down their right side. So yeah. CSA, after pulling back like off of Victory Hill, you guys eventually fell back. JD did like this big push with all their guys out. He kind of charged the union and all died out of line. Did they? Yeah, yeah they I almost heard, that, I heard that in the officer chat. I, yeah, I heard, I think it was either Doug or someone else like yell at JD and asking them what the hell they were doing. Really? Okay, because I was yeah. going to ask this as well. Um, and it was going to be part of a, like a two part question. One is the answer to the second question, which was, was that part of the plan for you guys to have JD no, going out? In no, the that, of was, the field that was, completely, that was completely on JD. Uh, they didn't uh, communicate that. They didn't communicate that at all. And they just did it. Mm -hmm. Because, uh, from what we could tell, um, just for your guys' information, uh, they took a lot of out of lines. I wiped. mean, a lot. They kept getting wiped and sure they, they inflicted a lot, but you guys have to understand on Tucker's church, you have to shoot like you you have to shoot twice as many. They get like fifty percent more. Tickets. I don't know if JD was even in the officer chat. To be honest. <laughs> yeah, I, I do have to say some real quick. Uh, uh, the few things I said that were actually uh legible in the uh in the, meeting no, before uh the fucking event, I said on Tucker's church, do not push the right side if you don't have to. Stay the fuck away from it. Don't push there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For that exact fucking reason. It's oh, so Carl, easy to get I just wanna, I just wanna put my hand on your shoulder and just squeeze a bit. And just, it's, it's okay, mate. 
Oh my! No, there was the there was the there was the point. Gonna get me going again, Zap. It was a oh, good fight. It was oh a good boy. fight. Oh, both sides. The second one. It was a there fucking was, brawl to say the there least. There was a point though. There was a point in that second match when I heard Zap Star just give off the most fatherly tone, like a a father trying to like you know calling his kids like you get back here right now. Yeah, I, we we <laughs> caught some of those moments And it was too. the best thing ever. It was so funny. He's oh, like, you get when back I called Delaware to me? It's when you said Del you're like, Del uh, yeah, I think we so. kept telling him, we kept telling him, and then Zap Star is just Delaware, come back Wait, here right now. <laughs> <laughs> and then I just see I see their whole line starting to yeah, shift. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we were pulled back in cover, we just weren't pulled back with you. We weren't taking casualties, except for my dumbass. I come out somehow. I, I know, I know. But we needed everyone back. And I, no, I remember I, saying I, I, in Officer Shadow, I'm just like I like Delaware, get to the star. Right. I now. know. It was so <laughs> funny, dude. I think I think we caught a moment where you were sitting in the woods, Zap, and you're just telling your boys, Ah, yes, lads, don't worry. The Yankees will come across this field. Or something like that. <laughs> yeah. You were like reassuring. And I was like, Man, I kinda calmed down after that. You know, I, I kinda got a Zen feeling. After that, I almost switched my religion because of that. Zapstar, <laughs> Zapstar definitely what. knows that uh, he definitely knows how to call my situation, even when it's very intense and chaotic. Oh yeah, Preach. The best part about that, mate, I don't know if you caught it, but I just said shoot out two lads who had team killed each other back. There. <laughs> oh, <laughs> just see, at, at the, the top of my lungs. At the beginning of the first round, we were watching Union artillery, and this one Union artillerist was about to fire his gun. And then the other guy walks up to him with his sponge and beats him to death. <laughs> and he what? fired he fired the cannon for him. Yeah. It, was like a mu it was like a mutiny. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> that was great. Oh, oh, and you got it on film. That's yeah. great. Because yeah, I was I like, wow, this, this is such a great view for a great artillery shot. The artillery Dude, shot was artillery short. Was Did you dox him? Does it show who it Oh, was? yeah, you see Oh, absolutely. It I forgot what the guy's reg is. I know his name. Oh, that's cool. So I'll see it. But, uh, lads, if I could yes, just Zach. go on and explain what we do. <laughs> Sorry, Zap. So, Maryland and Florida were, of course, part of Sussie's uh, engagement in the center. We are meant to kind of act as a mobile reserve if needed to move right or left. I kept Maryland and Florida to the right of the church. There's a small defilade there, uh, kind of in the woods. Keeps you kind of out of range of enemy artillery, and you can react quickly from there. Uh, very rapidly, of course, the Union moved towards taking the nipple. From there, we moved behind the church. And we're engaging them from the caissons. And from my perspective, we're inflicting pretty decent casualties upon them while taking minimal ourselves. Uh, we later evolved into rolling volleys. So falling back from those caissons further into the woods, get our loads, come up, fire. And uh, I think we were doing really well at that point. And uh, then we got the, uh, the call to fall back and then fall back farther and fall back far. <laughs> yep. And... Uh, then we were struggling to curtail these uh, secondary units, or not secondary units, but other units that uh, just didn't really seem to understand what we were doing. <laughs> so they kept taking casualties. And uh, we, we, in the officer's chat, we're sitting there and we're just like, where are these fucking casualties coming from? And we're watching us just go f closer and closer to taking loss. And finally, I think we were like maybe two out of lines away from being in taking losses when you guys capped. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, uh, later we came up. Uh, the first counter charge to retake point was repulsed, as they said. Uh, I think it was still kind of ongoing fighting, though, throughout the entire period. We finally repulsed the Union. Then we moved the team up behind Victory Hill. Uh, we were doing very well there, I believe. And then uh, I did hear Murphy call to move Sussy, and I knew that didn't uh, pertain to my detachment off to the left to counter the Union's movements. And then for one reason or another, the entire rest of the team went with them. Uh -huh. and, it was... <laughs> and it was just Maryland and Florida there. And we just see this blue wave coming forward towards that hill. And uh, I was fully prepared to make our last stand there. And I argued, I argued for it in officer's chat. And finally, finally, uh, you know, the, the voice is won over. And uh, I knew we were going to take substantial casualties withdrawing. But I think we only took probably like maybe eight pulling out of that position. But that was enough. At that moment, as soon as we reached Dunker's Church, last stand, we should have stayed. And I won't be doing it again. Next time, I run on my own initiative 
and I sell the office a shot to go fuck itself. <laughs> Hopefully Amen next that. time I don't have a hundred and like twenty guys follow me to the nipple. <laughs> God. <laughs> anyway. Oh. I knew you Fuck. were struggling back there, Zap. I felt for you from the other side. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hey, gentlemen, it was an honorable, honorable defeat on the second map, and the first map, I believe, was a glorious victory. But either way, everyone did their part. Every regiment here tonight did fantastically. That's all I have. Fuse while you got any more questions? Look, about this pitch time we were talking about last Wednesday, I mean, I just can't get enough of it. It's just this this shit. Oh, it's gold, baby. It's fucking gold. Honestly, guys, hey, well done. That Those two fights, even though on the second map there was a little bit of turtling, it felt different than most turtle matches because um, it was actually a very hard-fought battle. Like, uh, we caught a lot of, if you guys will see in the video, the opening shot of CSA pulling up to the fence line and shooting down onto the Union as they were coming coming up, that was a sight to behold. And as the Union was charging, you guys off the point, again both sides, very well done. I don't think I really have any questions pertaining to the strategy. We kind of got a general gist of it as explained, but yeah, that JD uh, whatever was going on with that, that was the only question I had. Was did you guys tell him to do that? And obviously we we figured that out, but uh. Yeah, I think it, I think that definitely cost you guys a lot. I don't like it because you guys were even for the first part of the map. Uh, you know, uh, when did you guys actually make the decision when you realized you were taking too many uh, tickets? You know, was it about when you guys were pretty much even, or when it really started to hammer home that you guys were at engaged and they were still at battle ready? Like, what was, you know, what was kind of the all right, get the fuck out call for that moment for you to CSA. I think there was some discussion while we were still battle be battle ready battle ready uh, to maybe like pull back a little bit, but like as soon I think as soon as we hit engage and they were still at battle ready, we were like, yeah, we need to you know pull back a, a bit further than right. that. Right, and then it was just gradually pulling back further and further and further. Uh, I see. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, but well done, guys. Zapstar is always a glory to see that beautiful battlefield nerf. Well done, CSA. Well done, Union. Well done. Anyone Kudos. else have any other comments or questions before we call them off for a night? Uh, check out the Delaware merch. Yep. Very cool. Also, Delaware wasn't always right next to First Maryland, uh, Fifth Florida, yada yada, rest of the Saucy Corps, but uh, we were always, for the most part, at least close by. Uh, and I think with that Victory Hill thing that Zap mentioned, if I remember correctly, I could be retarded here, we didn't actually go to the left. We went behind the church just so that way we weren't getting shot at and then we charged when the union came so you left us out there to die carl no, actually, no no oh, no we were still <laughs> even oh i'm second just shouted yourself uh, even <laughs> even within delaware there's a little bit of argumentation because i argued yes. to stand behind zafstar and support him yes that but was just a bad Carl, call on my part. I take all out. responsibility for that. Shit happens. Shit happens. <laughs> I, I was only kidding when I said that. <laughs> no, no, I, I know. But, again, Delaware always tried to be there. No, oh, the only regret I have is falling back from that position. I, oh, I do right. feel I, I do I, feel uh, that uh, had we remained, they would have built a statue oh, yeah. in honor of my own Florida. <laughs> no <Yeah>. last <laughs> I only regret getting shot in the fucking head twice out of nowhere in the woods. Is it more important to win the game or win the respect of your opponents? Exactly. See, I, I feel exactly. as long as both sides have Trump fun, that's all that matters. That for that for mm -hmm. himself, it's definitely a, my goal had fun. at the end is to win in such a way that we can be respected. All right. I, do, I just sometimes you got to do what you got to do. Right. And sometimes that means that y'all have to cap the point sooner and stop trying to be so stubborn about that taking losses. But, you know, hey. I, it is what it is. I love you guys. Hey. Hey. Yeah, In other words, guys, we got Turtle merch coming out on BLN now oh, starting today. Oh, <laughs> the the, 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 su the sussy high. turtle is, is infamous, all right? When I was around anyway, back in the day, when it had to be done, it was done. And we did it well. We won. We brought many games back from it. Well, he was kind of against the turtle while you've been gone, and now now you're back. Look what's well, no, back. and here's the thing. I was just, I get it. You know, I get it now. I can read the room. I understand. Yeah. All right. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I get it. I get it. Hey, There's Murphy, did you know Sebi. that turtling isn't really turtle. good anymore? I just yeah. want to, you know. Is there any active... What are your feelings on that? What are my feelings on it? 
to on Turtle if, if if you have any, you know, listen. Don't actually, no. Ultimately, like it was just it wasn't even a good turtle. All right, that's just <laughs> that's what it. I, I hate bad turtles. turtles. And I understand, really understand, understand me, turtle. understand me. Okay, we had the issue of not everyone pulling back. It took so long. Yeah. If everyone just goes all the way back and it's like that's it, then they'll well, just cap my, the point. They'll give up hope. Against it, like if you're gonna do it, it better work because like you're gonna lose. <laughs> well, a here's few... that's. That's my Social thing. Social credit score points. That's my thing. It's like if everyone, <laughs> if everyone had just under, just pulled all the way back, then y'all would have been like, okay, they're all the way back. Let's cap. And then it would have saved everyone time. It would have been way quicker. It would have made more sense. But it was just, you know, it's okay. It, it's, it's... Gentlemen, I'd like to announce new merch coming out soon. Oh, right, God. So, so it's a Sussy Civil War merch. You've got Murphy's avatar, and it says Pro Turtle, and you've got my avatar, and it's got anti-turtle and anti whichever I'm, sells more oh, will decide yeah, i'm gonna buy the anti -turtle. i'm definitely <laughs> buying the anti -turtle. <laughs> a box of the anti-turtle t-shirt dude get okay. a coffee mug with a pickle curl on it no dude the, poli no, no, the, pol the political climate in the sticker. world is gonna skyrocket after seeing pro turtle and like this is anti-turtle <laughs> no you gotta Look, get the stickers and everyone wears them yep there's gonna be <laughs> buttons you know <laughs> all right it's okay uh, so yeah I uh, thank you all for watching tonight's event. It was a great event. Glad to be a part of it. Uh, if you want to support the channel, go below the video, hit the join button, see perks and prices there. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next episode. Have a good night, everyone.